the sun is up, the sky is blue, it's beautiful, and so are you. Um, words of encouragement, reaching new milestones, um, encouraging our new abilities, encouraging, accepting all sides of ourself. I'm hearing dark shadows, maybe some things that because of culture, because of just unnecessary other people's chatter opinions, we've had to kind of bargain with ourselves, trying to push ourselves to do things to feel a certain type of way just because we were told like, I keep hearing dark shadows, like it's just not as extravagant, as polite, as well kept, as cultured if we don't do things this way, if we don't follow this way with the brand influence I'm hearing, social influence, social media now, seeing like Instagram, uh, YouTube, TikTok, even Twitter. I'm also hearing like breakdown, like a meltdown. I'm seeing like a, it's like fondue, but it's like chocolate instead of cheese that's being melted. Um, like it feels like taking some type of pain some type of information i'm also hearing disinformation misinformation taking these things i'm seeing the rugrats um and seeing them as kind of uh silly and mature knowing that uh some people i'm hearing people will be jerks and then they jerk off to you like they <laughs> it's a very <laughs> We're being very distinct in how this uh, message wants to come out. Just like misplacing people's anger, their jealousy, their side eyes, their um, unnecessary, I'm hearing return to sender type energy. Just like people wanting to throw shade, be mad because you're so unique because you are sticking true to yourself no matter what that means to you. And what damage does that do really if you aren't willing to show up in your own space for you in your own right knowing that all of you is light dark whatever you want to call it it's part of you you are wholesome on every level you are new you are finding new directions i'm hearing i'm also seeing misplaced sad influence like this message uh kind of came out earlier and a longer reading i was doing but just really like watching yourself knowing that you don't have to engage, don't have to suck in, don't have to soak in, I'm hearing, um, with other people's negative stuff. Like, it doesn't matter, it's not necessary. Some people, even if, maybe it's sometimes, like, you think it's coming from a better place, like, they're trying to be more mature, logistic, realistic, I'm hearing, but it doesn't work with your path, it doesn't work with your life, so it doesn't matter. Um, if anything, it's just showing you how to better trust yourself, trust your own positive influences, your own support system, your own guides, more than the bullshit that people are trying to throw at you. I keep seeing um, Winnie the Pooh uh, eating a whole bunch of honey, and then Piglet comes over and he's like, you shouldn't be eating all that honey, I read it in a book. And like Winnie the Pooh's like, I'm, I'm going to continue to eat my fucking honey, bro this is what's keeping me stress free this is what i know is good for me this is what i know has been working why should i have to change just because you heard someone else's influence just because you took in someone else's misinformation it's not your problem i uh, keep hearing engage engage beautiful moment maybe this will uh show you that some people are actually not receiving that much clarity not really respecting themselves in all the ways that you may have thought um and that's why you need to understand that these can be a bad influence if you let it if you let it infiltrate but it also enrich you because it can show you how powerful you are because you're probably giving signs clues ahead of time like yo this person's not for you this person does not have the right useful information to give you this person is kind of phony kind of fake this person is just like i'm hearing double down on payments maybe someone being weird about some type of transaction business transaction maybe you offered them uh, some type of service some type of product and even them they're being shady in the review process i'm hearing like just certain people you need to protect yourself from even if it is having to deal with more professional settings like of course you want to keep bringing in your bag you know like feeling like oh yeah i'm producing more into my life i'm manifesting more things into my life but just being cautious if anything comes up that really is not for you. Setting boundaries, knowing ahead of time you are already prepared, manifesting that, praying that to be prepared for anything that wants to come. I'm also hearing allocating insurance, which to me means 
uh but sorry the camera cut off but allocating uh insurance just to me means like trusting you can kind of free fall a little bit and let the divine like your guides your support system ancestors whatever um you believe in whatever showing up i'm hearing angels realigning um just trusting they're doing what they gotta do because i keep hearing most trust maybe some of you have set in prayers have set intentions and you're still not uh respecting and accepting that you're being heard you're being watched over you're being guided and don't let your guidance system don't make it to be something that you need to bash or feel foolish about um and especially if it's like seems to be i'm hearing like chasing chasing trendy backseat um i'm hearing maybe let let god let your higher self your own influence show you what things are just trendy and not really part of your experience like asking for that clarity for that expansion of knowledge even an explanation of why okay like this isn't really my type of church why is that this isn't really the type of workforce work environment i need to be longer why is that show it to me give me the signs and the universe will give you that sign um it can come in different forms of synchronicities, it can come from other people, but this is where I'm like, bad influence just keeps coming out. Sad influence. Some people are not even in their right mind all the time because they're just dealing with mental disorders, just other things going on. I'm hearing bashful, bashful, um, and also family connection. Like sometimes we feel like we have to trust or respect certain things from our cultures, but these people ahead of us or even younger than us might not always know what they're fucking talking about like <laughs> they don't know what's always best for you and that's really just the message that just really wants to come through because it seems like we're really focusing on being able to anchor in being able to experience um what our role our purpose our big moments of life that are coming up these iconic ways that we can see ourselves um we can see our own influence our own ways of inspiring uh just like poking up more being showcased more um i'm hearing upload video so maybe some of you need to upload things more show yourself more if you feel comfortable doing that um and also like understanding your your relationship your balance the harmony with social media with the internet is also coming through um, having an exploration and upper hand, outsmarting things ahead of time. This has to do um, with money as well. Something about social influence, things going on in the background, now just working out in your favor. It's just setting these intentions eight weeks, eight months ahead because you're given all these choices, you're giving all these thoughts. Even some of you that are coming up as thought loops, I'm hearing close examination of them. Why are they coming up? And maybe it's because the divine is like, you can easily switch this right now. You have the power. We're showing you how the energy is manifesting. I'm hearing money manifesting. But if you want to factor in, yes, I want to stay financially financially secure, stable, and I want to move into financial freedom. You have to keep um, I hear, I keep hearing repost though, repost, like you have to keep <laughs> giving that information to yourself, to the universe. You have to keep at it, keep going, keep working for it. Know that some things will be effortlessly to you. Something that just keeps popping up in my head is like effortless living, effortless living. Like not having to do way too much shit when unnecessary, knowing when to relax, knowing when to let i'm hearing put it in god's hands <laughs> like i'm also seeing like reindeer rain reindeer uh santa claus coming in like just let it let those gifts come in be ready to receive more be open to receive more um sending prayers to be energetically more aligned energetic energetic centers more pure more outstanding and how they'll work for you in your vessel um all these things can help you feel more grounded feel more respected i'm hearing respect is coming out a lot um but yeah, working with manipulation in your favor. That's why your mind is so powerful. Don't be afraid of it. Use it to your advantage. Stop making it like it's your enemy. Don't identify with all your thoughts either. All these emotions, you're just the awareness experiencing all these things. All these things can change, can pass. Um, and you're not a bad person if you trust right away that your intuition is telling you this person is off, this new person I'm mean, or like you just recognize some energy with someone you might have been close to or have to see often has changed. You're not a bad person for recognizing that. You're not a bad person.